What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be a bit of a product review video. We're going to be talking about Toner's brand new board, the Joyride, and touching on why I think this is one of the best beginner to advanced kiteboards that money can buy. So let's go. One, three, five, go! Uh, coming from the wild, wild west indeed. Okay guys, so yeah, today I'm just going to kind of highlight the main reasons why I'm stoked to now have the Joyride in Toner's lineup. If you're brand new to Toner, basically we have three boards on our lineup. We have the Pop 2.0, which is the board I ride, the Flow 2.0, which is the board that Andre Philip rides, and then the Joyride, which is kind of the board for everyone. So today I'm going to highlight five reasons why you might want to check out the Joyride versus the Pop or Flow. Basically the Joyride is a brand new board in our lineup and it's a high performance free ride board. What does that mean? Basically it's great for people who are just getting into sport. And it's also great for people who just enjoy riding foot straps and sending moon booters. So let's jump into some of the main features of the Joe Ride right now. So first off, the Joe Ride is our first board that comes as a complete setup. So you get the toner slippers with it, you get a handle, and you get 1.5 inch booster fins with it. So it's a board that you can just buy and basically get straight out on the water and start progressing your riding. Two, the Joyride actually comes in a wide range of sizes. We have a 132, we have a 136, we have a 139, and a 145. And a 145 is kind of the ultimate beginner board because it's a great size for beginners. And it also comes with a double row of inserts. And having the double row of inserts is a very useful thing for someone who's just getting into riding and trying to go up wind because it allows you to actually put your toner slippers or any foot straps kind of further back on the board and that just allows you to hold your edge a little bit more on a bigger board and really just makes the process of learning how to hold an edge and go up in a lot easier. Along with that the Joyride also has a refined rocker line so it has a little bit less rocker than the pop and flow but it also has a wood core and a carbon panel across the center of the board. So the Joyride kind of rides that line of being kind of flat enough to make the ride very predictable and easy for a beginner but having the internals of a high performance board with the wood and carbon paneling all right guys so hopefully you're enjoying the video so far but before we get too lost in the rest of today's video i want to take a second to introduce you guys to derek camacho he's one of the co-founders at toner and he's also the shaper and master buying behind all of the toner boards the pop the flow and this board the joyride He's been shaping for over 30 years, shaped his first board at 14. So without him, we wouldn't have any of the awesome products that we have today. So we're gonna jump over to the Toner Shaping Room, introduce you guys, and he's just gonna touch on a little bit of the tech stuff for the Joyride. So let's go. Hello, and uh, welcome to Toner Shaping Room. Today I'm gonna talk about Toner's uh, free ride board, the Joyride. So the Joyride, uh, it's a very versatile board. It's designed very, very clean. It has a very simple bottom shape. It has uh, basically a simple concave in the middle, as you can see there. And as you move it towards uh, the feet position, it goes flat with a nice flat entry of the tail. What this does is allows it to be uh, very clean, very efficient. So it's a fast board and it also allows you to handle stronger winds and, and chop conditions very nicely because there's not a lot going on underneath the board at all. There's the water, is a very clean uh, release of the tail of the board. So it's actually great uh, for learning, it's great for choppy conditions and it's great for uh, flat, uh, glassy water. Okay guys, so hopefully you enjoyed kind of just hearing Derek's thoughts on the Joyride and also got to see a little glimpse of the Toner Shaping Room. I want to do a whole video series on, you know, what goes on in there because it's super duper cool and fascinating and something that I think most people forget about. Every board starts handmade, which is pretty freaking sick. Uh, but yeah, before we round out today's video, uh, we're going to actually head over to Andre Phillips House, who's the big homie and also the second co-founder of Toner, just to kind of pick his brain on... The Joyride. So let's go. What's up guys? So just to follow up with what Jake and Derek were saying about the Joyride, you know, our goal was to build a board that's going to be great for beginner to advanced skateboarding. And what we really didn't want to do is build a beginner board that you're going to outgrow as soon as you learn how to go upwind. 
So we spent a lot of time on the shape and rocker line and added the right amount of tech to help you bum up wind, boost big airs, and enjoy progressing into an advanced kiteboarder. Alrighty guys, so yeah, that pretty much sums up today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed meeting some of the Tona crew. Derek and Dre are playing a huge role in kind of everything Tona's doing. And yeah, hopefully you guys learned some stuff about what makes a good kind of beginner to advanced kiteboard. I think the Joyride does a great job at ticking all those boxes. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed today's video. If you want to check out the Joyride or check out any more of the Tona products, you can head over to tonalife.com. And because you guys are awesome and you guys are watching this video, you can use a promo code called Kite Like Jake to get 10% off your order. So yeah, go check out the link in the description or click right up here to head over to Tona. Uh, go scope it out. We're doing some fun stuff and I can't wait till I see more and more people on board with what we're doing. So yeah, big thanks for tuning in. I really appreciate you guys watching all the way to the end and I'll see you guys soon in another video. Peace, love and big ups.